Well, hey guys, we're here at the polytunnel. Um, we've decided on on the tasting test the other day. We had um, one for for tea. Um, the market more cucumbers. Um, really big yielding um, cucumber. Um, it's a bit spiny. Spits really really sharp spikes on the uh, on the fruit itself um it absolutely gone berserk in this corner absolutely going absolutely berserk um but we found taste wise it just didn't cut it right sneeze coming on then um yeah we we um we tried it both ways, we peeled it um, and we um, tried it with and without the peel on um, and it just wasn't wasn't good at all, was it Han? No. Um, um, but we've got uh, another two uh, cucumber plants in there uh, called Fem Spot, um, and to be honest, they taste a lot better, much more high high yield than uh, tomato, tomato cucumber, um, and just overall all better really. Um, so yeah, a bit of a bit of a thumbs down for the. Uh, the market more. I um, don't know whether it's because we're growing it in the polytunnel, um, where there's not a lot of bugs can get into um, pollinate it, um, where we're having to pollinate it ourselves. Um, we've got some planted under the cube, uh, under the beans there, and um, they seem to be um, coming on. So. We'll have a bit of a, a trial with those there and see what, what happens Ooh, with those. That's beastly, man. Um, that is a good one, that, isn't it? <laughs> Not a bad one. Cucumber at all? Yeah, it's been laying Yeah, a little bit, a bit manky on the bottom. Don't worry about it. Right, that's how there's, there's plenty of uh, cucumbers coming on on these. We've got some more cucumbers up on the on the table over there to uh, put in and and get going um, to see how they go. Um, but we're just tidying up the tomatoes again. Um, does that look better? It does look loads better, yeah. Um, so yeah, we had three cucumber plants, uh, two fem spot and the market mall, um, just there. And uh, yeah, it's um, I say loads of flowers and little fruit coming, coming on. Um, but uh, yeah, just not the best tasting one, I'm afraid. Um, I just tasted a, a young one, and they, they did taste a little bit better, but not, but not by by a lot really. Um, so yeah, we won't be growing uh, um, market more cucumbers next year. Um, we'll stick to a F1 variety, an all female variety, because um, they really heavy cropping and uh, taste a, a heck of a lot better than uh, the market more, don't they, hun? So, That's better, isn't it? You've got a better view there now. Yeah. I'll clear it up that side. I need to get in and weed that now. Um, we've got, got um, some strange uh, tomatoes here. have got loads of trusses on here. Um, yes, I know we should probably um, limit the plant to how many trusses it can do, but it's, uh, it's not struggling at the minute. Um, we're feeding it once a week, and uh, I don't know if you can just see in there. Um, 
freaking green man. Where's the cucumbers? And uh, that's on that wire. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we, we wanted to really um, just tidy the, the cucumbers up because they were falling out over onto the uh, walkway here. Um, and uh, really just to see, just to tidy up really. Um, so we've been having a look, see if we can trim them back, and we can, so we trimmed them back and, uh, and uh, got on with it, so. There we go guys, that's uh, what we're up to. We'll, um, we'll crack on and finish tidying up. And uh, see what else, see if there's any more under here that we can uh, harvest for today. Um, starting to get a little bit of coloration coming in the some of the alicante tomatoes. You can't quite tell but the naked eye they do look a little bit um, different colour so um, yeah not all uh, not all bad so we've got a couple of cucumbers up there off the uh, fem spot and uh, we'll um, catch you later guys cheers for now